execute each slice at its intended target point. Next up is Joel's final weapon. It's one of the most carefully guarded fighting techniques in all of Silat Gaia. In the hands of a master, the weapons of Malaysia's martial arts Silat Gayong can be lethal. Targeting ligaments, the throat, and eyes. But blades aren't the only weapons in a Silat warrior's arsenal. In Malaysia, a traditional form of dress for men and women is the sarong. A long piece of cloth that's wrapped around the waist like a skirt or a kilt. For Silat fighters, a sarong is also a weapon. It's called the chindai. Jaswan demonstrates a chindai attack. The chindai technique is so secretive in Silat Gayong that it's only shared with the most advanced students. Chindai is the uh, Malay traditional technique. It's a simple technique and it doesn't require a lot of energies. And that's why we wait until the student reaches a certain level for us to reveal the techniques of the Chikra Chindai. So when you, you throw it over the head and you, and you catch, you pull them into you and you do like a, like you, you, that's when you start to like, like strangle, yeah. Yeah. choke. Okay. Now, motion capture allows us to slow down a Chindai strike and see why a simple cloth can be such a terrifying weapon. First, the warrior executes a surprise attack from the rear and wraps his enemy's entire head in the sarong. Then, a twist. As the cloth is pulled tight, it clamps down on both the windpipe and carotid artery in one go. Oxygen and blood supply to the brain are cut off. Now, with his enemy gasping for breath, the Silat warrior pulls him to the ground. The true power of a Chindai strike is not just physical. It attacks primarily around the throat area, so it takes your wind away. And this is one of the things that's great about Silat, actually, is the psychological game that it plays with your opponent. Because I take your air away, and then I just keep going. So it's kind of like, it's like a drowning feeling, and you start to panic. And it's that panic feeling that you want to put in your opponent because that's what makes it psychological. Joel works to learn a full range of Chindai strikes. It's the last technique he has to master here at the training center. Jaswan is pleased with Joel's Chindai technique. Joel has now mastered many of Silat's most difficult fighting methods. Deadly support, Seligi, the Kuris, and Karambit. And finally, the surprisingly simple and crippling Chindai.